マッキーでよーかわしいいつかわしいなんかキーブレカンツそう、今日は、私たちのようなハーブをお伝えしてみてください。まず、私たちのようなハーブをお伝えしてみてください。ゴジラティ、バングロウ、タミルネームはカビ、カナダネームはホンガネソップ。And botanical name is Eclipta alba, and the English name is Trailing Eclipta. So, next, let us go to the introduction of this plant. So, its annual sprouting small plant stands straight with numerous, numerous branches. It has roots at the knots, and white flowers grow in the form of heads.、Uh, so, this, these are the features of this plant. And the propagation is、um, the height,、uh, not the height,、uh, it grows 6,000 feet above the sea level or the water body level. And、uh, this plant is very good for many diseases. And also, the propagation should be done in a nice soil, like this. This plant is grown superb because、uh, daily my mother puts the water for these plants. And we have a terrace garden, so she puts water. And also, features, propagation,、uh, and properties. It's kapha and vata shamak. And also, it's good in digestive functions and especially beneficial for the hair and excites spleen. So, let's start with the diseases that it can cure.、Uh, no, we go to the Chemical composition. It has、uh, alkaloids in it. And also, we go to the qualities. It's a n t h e l m i n t i c and anti dermatosis. And、uh, the next, we go to the diseases. It can cure. So, it can cure、um, cough, cold, fever, liver disorders, multinodular tuberculosis,、uh, migraine, headache. No, it says migraine. And hair disorders, eye disorders, and also stomatitis, chronic rheumatitis, cholera, diphtheria, diarrhea, and also diabetes, diabetic carbuncles, burns, giddiness, itching, uh, uh, scorpion bite, and can increase, increase longevity, sorry, not increase, increase longevity, and also it can. Uh, help cure in、uh, digestive functions and also it's beneficial for the hair. And also, you can make dosa, sambar, and eyeliner that I've worn here. So, the next thing it is, it can cure burns and then cough, cold, fever that I told you. And also, it can cure scorpion bite. So, First, let's start with the diseases it can cure and how it cures it. So, cough. So, you have to take the、uh, leaf of it, and then、uh, it can cure for spleen disorders and、um, liver disorders, cough, cold, and fever, and loss of appetite. 4 to 6 ml of training a good dad's juice and 30 ml of milk. You have to、uh, mix them together and give it every morning anyway. In case you have typhoid, you can give、uh, two teaspoonful juice of t r i l i n g e c l i p t a to the patient. And、uh, it can also cure stomatitis. You have to give、um, five gram leaves of it.、Um, and you have to chew it and spit the saliva out. And then you have to、uh, chew it several times a day, like this only. And then it cures all oral problems. So then we go to the next herb,、uh, next disease is done here, not herb,、uh, multinodular tuberculosis. So you have to 
take the leaves and prepare, uh, grind it and prepare a cake and then you have to take the cake and uh, roast it in ghee and then tie it on the multinatural tuberculosis, the tumor of it. And then we go to the next disease, chronic rheumatism. So for chronic rheumatism, take 250 ml of the leaf juice and 250 ml of sesame oil and 10 gram rock salt. Heat the soil in low heat, uh, on the gas in low heat and put all these things and then uh, till then the oil is left. So you have to take this oil and put 10 drops of it in each, no in each nostril and uh, you have to take put 10 drops in each nostril and uh, then you have to uh, give it to the patient to put 10 drops in each nostril and after that it, uh, it releases cough, infectious cough and also worms that are stuck and also it's very beneficial in removing chronic changes. So the recommended food for this is chapati of wheat and moong dal or green gram. So you have to uh, eat this. This is the food. And then we go to blood pressure. So how to cure blood pressure is you have to take uh, two teaspoonful juice of training crypta and um, two teaspoonful juice and also one teaspoonful uh, honey. And you have to mix this both and give this and give this to the patient twice a day and it cures blood pressure next disease is cholera so you have to take the um, juice of it and then uh, it's very efficient in cholera also to take the juice of it the juice of the leaves are beneficial and uh, diabetes so you have to take a uh, powder of training it a uh, trying eucalyptus leaf and you have to mix it with flour of bubble powder of flour of bubble and then you have to uh, mix it with that both of them you have to mix it with 6 gram ghee and 5 gram sugar candy you have to mix this all and give this to the patient uh, 3 to 4 times a day and it cures diabetes so the next thing is you can cure diabetic carbuncles also and also scorpion bite. You have to take the leaves of it and then you have to apply it on the where, where it was bitten, scorpion bite and also special use. So the special use for this is you have, you have to take the leaves, shade dry the leaves and then you have to grind it into fine powder and sieve it through a cloth and then keep it store it in a bottle and take one gram of this powder with six gram ghee and five gram sugar sugar i think i told you wrong for diabetes uh, but it's beneficial in diabetes too so you have to take this much and then you have to give it, give it to the patient and uh, it's beneficial in many diseases and it helps the uh, patient to be healthy so the next disease so the next disease we can see is, yeah, uh, also it can uh, make longevity. So you have to take 10 ml juice of training eucalyptus leaf in the morning and um, you have to take, uh, you have to take only milk for one month at least and then you will become fully healthy without any disorders but I don't think anybody can do that because it's very difficult. So, I think we can try it once. So, migraine, you can also cure migraine. You have to take the uh, leaf juice and uh, equal quantities of the leaf juice and also uh, equal quantities of goat's milk and you have to mix it all. Actually, for diabetes, I forgot to tell you. Uh, you have to take the, the these two powders, bubbles, flowers powder, and also you have to take training with Krita's leaves powder, and you have to mix this both with equal amount of uh, sugar to the amount of water, and you have to mix them both, uh, mix them all, and um, give this mixture with goat's milk to the patient, and it cures diabetes. So for migraine, you have to uh, take the leaf, 
juice and you have to mix it with goat milk heat equal quantities of both and then you have to uh, put two drops of this mixture in the nose and um, then you have to uh, also mix black pepper in it also if you want you can mix black pepper in it and then you have to apply it on the forehead so these are the cures of trailing eclipta it can also cure chronic rinders, copy and bite and also diphtheria, stomach pain uh, you have to take 10 gram leaf juice and 3 gram black salt and um, with little uh, yeah you have to give this to the patient grind it and give it to the patient and the next thing yeah it has a shloka also and also it can cure many diseases like cholera and also piles, anemia, spleen disorders, liver disorder, uh, spleen enlargement and liver disorders and also cough, cold and fever so it can cure so many diseases loss of appetite or anemia, uh, piles, fistula, filaria so many diseases so hasn't God given this to us so thanks to God and also uh, we can also make many things out of it like kajal uh, the eyeliner that I have here and also we can uh, make dosa out of it sambar out of it my mother makes dosa and sambar out of it and also you can use it as a hair paste my mother puts it every Friday I take hair bath my mother puts it in the mix and she applies it over here so it's very good in so many diseases so Jai Shri Krishna Jai Shri Ra now I'm showing you only the plant how nice it looks my mother's terrace garden she has planted this in it so Krishna <laughs> This is all about telling it. Telling it. Yeah, I'm just telling it.